Hello everyone! Welcome to another special Amigos Play. I'm Amigo Aaron. And tonight, we're going to look at another in the series of games we're giving thanks for. These are gifts uh, sent to me by various uh, great and dear friends of the show. And tonight, as you can tell, we're going to be looking at this. Wild Cup Soccer. I believe this was a gift from Ravi Abbott. A great man, a good and dear friend of ours, and co-host of the Retro Hour uh, podcast, amongst the top retro gaming podcasts on the planet. Uh, and he sent me this along with a ton of other stuff, magazines and everything else. And so I thought tonight would be a good night to give this a shot. I've not played it before. Now, I believe we covered another game from this company, but it's been so long ago that I just can't remember what it was. Uh, I'm going to be using the trusty... G uh, the Amiga CD32 stick. I am going to be playing this on my 1200 as opposed to the CD32. So let's give this thing a whirl. <coughs> I'm just going to play a uh, an unfriendly here. And we'll give it a shot. As you know, I am a soccer genius. And so this should be no problem uh, for me to figure out. Okay. Let's see who we got here. The Bruisers, Cowboys. Well, heck, I have to play the Cowboys. All right. No boat tonight. I like the music in this. I like the opening uh, video there. It looked like uh, the Lord had come down for a game of soccer. Or like a really bad-looking Santa. Okay. So I guess we can actually update these gentlemen. And I guess these are... This is interesting. I guess we can pick who we want to play. I think that's what we're doing here. Let's just go ahead and give it a shot. <coughs> this is a popular figure out what you're doing section of the game. Now, I believe this game was uh, not praised, as I recall. Oh, that's cool. I like that. Okay, this is so far. I'm into it. <laughs> okay. Holy smokes! Looks like we're some elephants are taking on some dinosaurs. No, no, no. Oh, cool goal. <coughs> Let's try that again. Just got to get my buttons worked out here and I'll be fine. Oh, jeez. My team's just getting decimated. Shoot the ball, dude. There he goes. Good wide feel, good scrolling. Sound effects, pretty good. There we go, now it's time for me to start doing some damage. Good lord, this, this is an immense field. Oh, there's the goal. <laughs> it was so huge, I couldn't tell where it was at. Don't get up, the goalie's down. Oh, so close. This is the, the it's got to be the largest pitch in the history of soccer. <coughs> I don't know what that face means. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Oh, get in there. Oh, 
It's getting bloody. Oh, gosh. Trust me, I'm as frustrated as you are watching. My elephant made came so close to scoring. Clear me out of here. I'm not giving much of a running commentary here. Just taking all my brain power. To, uh oh. Don't want to let him get across back across the pitch here. If I could just set up a one play. Get it. Get it. Get it. I'm in trouble shooting diagonally. I think. Oh, fuck it, I just got in control. <coughs> Clearly, you've got some gentleman that can't go across the line. Now, there, I, I see that's the team face. So, shoot it, shoot it, you idiot. Stop beating him! <laughs> this is what happens when you get carried away with the beat down. No, where are you going? Oh! Once I figure out how to get my scoring down, we'll be laughing. I could have scored several goals here. Double header! Oh! <laughs> Oh, he's been beheaded. No. No. Get up. Stop killing him. My God. I can't figure out why I can't score. I mean, I was right there. I've beheaded their goalie. That's got to count for something. This is the most frustrating thing I've ever done. <laughs> Whoa! Yes! I blew up six times, but I made it. I've never been so satisfied from a goal. <coughs> this is incredibly violent. I like it. When you give someone a header in this, you give them a header. You know, the other buttons don't seem to do anything. Well, I think I killed my own guy. It's odd to me that the Cowboys look like... I can't tell if those are... Maybe they're aardvarks or... I think I just would have made them cows. There it is. I think I figured out how you win. You just kill the other team's goalie. If only it was this way in real life. Oh. I think we've... Uh-oh. <coughs> it almost looks like he's shooting me. Now the ball is a, turned into a lead weight for a minute there. I suppose they can't get their goalie back. It can't be this easy. <laughs> this is bizarre. Oh, what the? Is that guy a ref? Or free kick? I 
I think we're almost out of time here. I like the hippogriff for the griffin or whatever that flies in with the ball. Maybe this is like the first team that is real simple just to make me feel like I know what I'm doing. It's working. Yes. Skunk rule in effect. I don't know what's happening now. <laughs> I don't, know why they, I don't know why they flew in the ball. And there you go. That's interesting. That's interesting. And you win more money and presumably you can upgrade your guy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> And now you get the uh, <laughs> you get the credits credit screen unusual well there you have it a very interesting game from Teak London very unusual Millennium I like the entrance I will say the music's good <laughs> that's an interesting cat there so I'd like to thank, I'm pretty sure this was from Ravi, and uh, he sent me a couple CD32 games, and uh, if it's not Ravi, I'll find out who it was for sure, but I'm pretty sure it's Ravi, but thank you very much for sending us this, we appreciate it, uh, often we'll cover these in future shows or uh, an Amigos play, so it's nice to get ideas and gifts, we really do appreciate it, so that's uh, Amigo Aaron signing off, adios.